You might be wondering, what is a rock crock? Simply put, it's the most versatile cookware around. It's a fully glazed ceramic cookware that's heat safe to 752 degrees Fahrenheit. They're your one-stop pots and pans, and you can use them on the grill, stovetop, microwave, oven, broiler, and as a slow cooker. When you're done eating, you can keep the leftovers in the rock crock and put it in the fridge or freezer, and put it in the dishwasher for easy cleanup. Since they can be used for so many kinds of cooking, you can start a meal on one heat source and finish on another. What other cookware can do that? They share much of the durability of cast iron, but they're much lighter, so they're easier to move from the stovetop or oven right to the table. Unlike cast iron and other ceramic cookware, they're ready to use right away. You don't have to season to start using them. Since rock crocks are made of clay, they heat evenly and help keep your food warm after cooking. Now that you know why you need a rock crock in your life, which one should you choose? We have something for every kind of cooking. The original Dutch oven is perfect for stews, braised meat, and one pot pasta for the whole family. For weeknight cooking, the everyday pan is a must. Use it for smaller families, side dishes, and even desserts. If you're looking for a smaller solution, the casserole is ideal for main dishes for two, side dishes, and desserts. The Dutch Oven XL is great for family style and batch cooking, or if you have hungry teenagers at home. The grill stone is made for veggies, flatbread, nachos, and of course, pizza. Use the small grill stone for personal size servings, side dishes, and grilled burger toppings. Here are a couple of important things when using your rock crock. When you're cooking on the stovetop, make sure the bottom of your rock crock is covered with liquid, like stock, oil, or butter. If you use your rock crock a lot, you might notice some discoloration or even a little oil buildup. Don't worry, it's not your glaze coming off. It's just residues that have developed over time. You can clean it off with baking powder paste or a little barkeeper's friend and a non-abrasive sponge. For more information about our rock crocks, including recipes, or to get your own, go to our website. We love the rock crock and know you well too.